It's Rescue Mission from 1987 for the Sega Master System. A light gun shooting game played with the Sega Light Phaser. Whereas an army sharpshooter, you are providing cover for medics who are riding a railway handcart deep into enemy lines to collect soldiers trapped and surrounded by bad guys. Rescue Mission is a relatively obscure Sega Master System game that deserves a revival. It's a simple game, you just protect the guy on the handcart. But it's quite challenging and outrageously fun once you start playing. Here's a look at the rescuers, each with their own personality. And while my light phaser was having a few issues, it would not shoot to the very left side of the screen. This works like any other old school light gun game. You just need to point and shoot the bad guys quickly and accurately. Note the landmines on the railroad tracks and some of the bad guys will launch rockets at you or throw grenades. Here's a look at the Sega Light Phaser working with a CRT television, which you'll need to play this game. Rescue Mission and other old school light gun games will not work on modern LCD TVs. Remember to be careful while playing this game and not to shoot your rescuer or the soldiers who need to be rescued. Oh, come on. You got in the way of my bullet. Hardly my fault. Why am I being penalized for that guy's incompetence? A good question. You know, this is a terrific fun game that should see a re-release. I would love to see Sega bring this one back on the Wii or the PlayStation 3 or something with one of the modern guns so that it can be enjoyed by a new generation on LCDs and projectors and plasma screens and stuff. And while it's not a great looking game, it's kind of bland. It has a charming cute style and is extremely fun and playable. Yay! We made it to safety! Now send those troops back out to fight. In order to play this game, you'll need a working Sega Master System and a functional Sega Light Phaser. Or at least the power base converter which works with the Sega Genesis. That's actually what I'm using. Although I am having problems with some of my Sega Master System hardware like the 3D glasses and the light phaser. This stuff is all getting very old by now, so if you're going to buy a light phaser or 3D glasses or any of the hardware, make sure you buy it from a trusted seller who can guarantee that it works. The way that it should, because some of this stuff may appear to work, but not work 100%. Anyway, a new light phaser will not cost too much to find. And there's many excellent light gun phaser shooting games available for the Sega Master System and other old school consoles like the Nintendo Entertainment System. It's a genre that's seeing a bit of a revival now with the Nintendo Wii and the other consoles and their motion controllers, but the style used in Rescue Mission is very old school and very different than a modern uh, shooter on rails like House of the Dead. And that's what sets Rescue Mission apart. It's quirky and cool and really fun. I'll totally recommend this game for the Master System. Not that the sound effects in this game are bad, but one of the things that you can do is enhance it with your own sound effects. Modern games just don't allow you to do that. There's too much noise. Headshot. Oh. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry won't bring him back to life now, will it? You bastard! Next time, instead of sending somebody in on a railway handcart, go with helicopters. But this game does it old school because it's Rescue Mission. Sissy, 